Okay, YouTube got a couple of coats of shellac on on my shelf supports here, so just letting that kind of air out in the sun today before I take them inside. But that's the next thing to do. I'll probably do that a little later today. We'll take these inside, put them on the shelf, and get them ready for the next shipment of parts that's coming in in a week or so. I'll show you that in a minute. Okay, YouTube, time to get my shelf supports put in here. Kind of have to work them in place around all of the posts and everything, but there we go. Got one in there, ready to go. And I got the got all my stuff moved off of the two that I reinforced, put one down there on the bottom. So now I gotta get everything sorted out because I've got about 500 pounds of inventory coming in in a week or so. And that's gonna end up on all four of those shelves. So at least now I'm ready for it. I've got all four reinforced and ready to go. So if you have some of these open mesh wire shelves, this is a good way to reinforce them. Makes the uh, shelf so it doesn't sag in the middle. That's what I was finding happening was right down in here the uh, shelf would sag that way and it would also sag that way from the weight because there's basically no support in the middle. These edges are pretty stiff but the middle of the shelf is is a little bit weak so this way if you put heavy material up here in the middle it stays pretty flat and I've had probably 200 pounds on one of these and didn't see any any bending at all so that that works pretty good kind of the combination of the shelf itself is fairly strong it's just the middle is a little bit weak and then putting that little lip on the back if you can see that up there so this this way it keeps me from pushing stuff off, off the back of the shelf that little um, piece of wood across there stiffens the plywood up a little bit and even the shellac I used here is really old it's better than 10 years old and I probably should have thrown it out but I was able to mix in a little denatured alcohol I kind of filtered off the reasonable shellac off the top and that's what I finished all of these boards with. So I've got uh, that one, that one was shellacked, and it's not furniture grade. This is just industrial shelving, so I just like the uh, little bit of shellac finish on there makes it slippery and kind of holds down the splinters so you're not getting splinters in your hand if you happen to brush up against it. So you want the, uh, the plywood to contact all of the wire over the whole surface for maximum strength. So yeah, thought I'd share that with you. If you found that interesting, give it a thumbs up, share it with your friends. You can check out my channel. I'll put a, uh, there's a subscription link in the lower right corner there. Subscribe for updates if you haven't already done so. And as always, thanks for watching.